into practice today. Uh, just just, just kind of take us through that. Did you guys see that? Did you guys see it? We, we heard it. Oh, you heard it. Uh, so we had our film of yesterday's scrimmage. Broke, about, it broke apart in the teams and we did that. And then we're expecting we're going to go through stuff on the court. And coach says, look, if Franz makes his half-court shot, everybody goes home. And we said, all right, Franz lined up and knocked it down. <laughs> so we were free. And guys are still here anyway, but we're free to leave. <laughs> That's awesome. Now, J.I., you guys have, have done a lot of – you did some scrimmaging this week to, to make up for some lost game time. What, what's been your interpretation of it? What have been your takeaways from the team scrimmaging? It's been great. We're, we're growing, um, continuing to learn each other. we got new guys um, that we're changing a bit of our scheme and the way we play in transition and early offense and everything like that. So we're learning as a team, uh, figuring each other out, but also competing at a high level. So it's been great to – to go at each other and work on turnovers, work on uh, end of game situations, out of bounds, all the things like that. You've, you've obviously been through kind of going year over year, over year, year over year, trying to rebuild a defense. What's the biggest challenge in trying to kind of get back what you guys had defensively last year? I know you guys are confident in that, but what's, I, what's the biggest challenge? Right? I think just not taking it for granted. I think it's, it's sometimes it's easy to fall into, oh, we were a great defensive team last year, so we'll be one this year. And you have to come with the right approach and uh, mindset that, uh, you know, nothing's given now. we got to go out and, and earn it again. And we don't just want to be as good as the defensive team we were as last year. We want to be better. And so I think just, uh, you know, ingraining that mindset in our guys, continuing to work on our fundamentals and our defensive side, and we'll be great. Do you guys feel like there's that there's an intensity and fire to, to get to get back there? Like there's a hunger to, you know, to, to, to be a better defensive team? For sure. I mean, just to be a better team, period. You know, guys are really locked in. Coach has been amazing. Um, so far this training camp, guys have been really competing and going hard. So um, I have nothing but uh, great expectations for us. I know you've played more in practice than, 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 than what we've seen publicly so far. But, you know, a lot was made of the weight that you put on. I know you said you, you felt like it would help you a little bit. How do, how do you feel like it's helped you so far through training camp? And, and, and what difference does, does it feel? It's been great. I just feel more solid. Um, I definitely need to continue to get my butt in shape, but I feel solid, I feel strong, uh, rebounding the ball, defending, everything just feels better with a, a, being a little more solid. Do you feel, do you feel the impact that, that you, can, you can make? I mean, obviously you know what you, know what you can do, but are you seeing that impact starting to, starting to filter its way through these scrimmages? And, and, and Absolutely. Like Absolutely. I mean, I, mean I, I know what I do, you know, uh, on the defensive end of the floor, but even on the offensive end of the floor, um, continue to knock down three-point shots. Uh, get involved in offense with pick and rolls and rolling to the basket and cutting and everything has been great too. So, you played the four and the five now throughout right. your career the last couple of years. Is there one that you're more comfortable with at this point, or is it kind of indifferent for you? No, most def most definitely more comfortable with the four. Uh, just from cutting, from screen and roll, everything. I just kind of know the four because I played it so much. Uh, five has been a little more difficult, but at the same time, it's been great. Like you know, during the scrimmage, I played some five, and uh, being able to run up and kind of stretch the floor as well as the five has been great. So. We'll see what happens. Yeah, you, you know what a good defender looks like. You're one. We've seen Jalen, KCP all at a high level. How good of a defender can Anthony Black be? I think he's right up there. You know, he has the he has the right approach. He's a pick you up 94 feet guy. Um, has great size and length and quickness for being his size. So um, I think he's going to have a, a breakout year both offensively and defensively. How, how much are you itching to, to play Friday and, and just get out and get get out in front of the fans at the Kia Center and, and, and see a different see a different opponent across the league? A ton. You know, we're ready to play ball. We've been we've been here in training camp. We have to you know have games. If we can't, so we're ready to play. So excited for the season. The interesting end to, to the practice session today. It uh, was kind of kind of take us through uh, you know how Franz helped you guys get out a little. Early. Um, you know, it's actually funny because um, I actually wasn't on the court at the time. I was coming out to the court. And um, when I was about to come out to the court, I just saw everybody, I heard everybody yelling and running off the court. So I heard the front at the half court shot to, um, to let us go home. To, uh, to make up for some of the, the lost game time, you guys have scrimmaged hard uh, here occasionally. What, what have been your takeaways from that, those scrimmages? Uh, just how competitive it's been. Um, you know, you know we have a competitive team, but just getting out here to battle against each other, I think we're, we're making everybody, we're, we're all making each other better. Um, you know, we're going hard. Moe's is trying to, you know, pull us back at times just because we get so competitive. You know, we are all on the same team. But I think we're making each other better. You know, unfortunately, we, we, uh, we missed that game against New Orleans uh, that past Friday. But, you know, we've been uh, making up for it, especially in these practices and getting two, two good scrimmages in this past week. Whether it's in game or practice or even just in film study, what kind of sticks out about this magic team that's maybe a little bit different from the other teams? Um, I would just say it's a level of communication so far. I mean, I just feel like everyone's talking.
Baltimore, everyone's speaking about what they see out there and the love of communication has been great. Um, guys have been holding each other accountable and it's been able to translate. I mean, it's been a very smooth, uh, you know, camp. Uh, we've been working hard, playing hard. And, um, we've been getting done everything we need to get done seamlessly and timelessly. And uh, it's been great. So I think it's thinking it's been going so smooth, especially with the competitiveness and learning, growing. Um, exactly what we want to see uh, heading into the season. You know, obviously you guys were one of the best defenses in the league last year. How do you go about rebuilding that? And do you feel like you guys, you know, what's the biggest challenge for rebuilding it? Um, you know, just uh, you know, stick it to our principles. We know we know the principles, our defensive principles from last year. Just continue to hone in on that, continue to be on the string, continue to communicate, and um, you know, play together. And that's what we've done. And uh, we've done a great job watching the film, looking at rooms for improvement. And it's uh, our defense has helped our offense just because we play so well defensively and going against both teams. Our offense has uh, is definitely picked up as well. You know, obviously, you kind of know how this is supposed to feel. With this. Does it feel like the defense has taken a step forward? Has taken a step forward, or is it? Is it where you guys wanted to be? I mean, we were what the number three defense last year. I mean, it's hard to go up, you know, you know, much more. But we're still definitely trying to improve. We're definitely trying to be better than we were last year. But I can definitely see the jump in like offense and taking our magic shots and getting the looks that we want to uh, we want to get on the offensive end. And uh, just continue to know that we're going to be a defensive team and being able to use the defensive stops to get on transition and make sure that we're getting the right shots we need on the offensive end. Have you seen Navy and Jeff progress in this game so far? Oh man, great. I mean, it's uh, their second year, got a year under their belt. Um, they're more comfortable, more confident. Um, AB's done a great job running the show with the second unit, uh, with his physicality, pushing the pace. Uh, Jets been a sniper throughout the whole camp, knocking down. I mean, we saw him get hot in the San Antonio game. So just seeing how, uh, you know, how eager they are to learn and for them to see him put it out there together in practice, and you know, it's been fun to see. You're eager to eager to get a game on Friday. I mean, I know you guys have been kind of sitting around here. Yeah, no, it definitely. It's uh, we're definitely getting that itch. You know, that's why I think it's been so competitive. You know, we've been around each other so much. So we definitely want to play against some uh, different colored jerseys. And uh, for us to get back out in front of Kia Center, I think everyone's excited. Uh, you know, we missed that last one on Friday, which kind of, you know, it, unfortunate. But you know, you know, you can't control control things you can control. But. Uh, definitely looking forward to getting back out there and uh, finish out the preseason strong, getting ready for the regular season. What, what if, you know, a lot, a lot of us kind of made, made of the weight that J.I. put on and, and him just kind of getting back into being a more re you know, regular kind of full-time player. What have you seen from him in the camp and, and how, has he, how has he progressed in the world? Um, I would just say he's just like, I mean, he's he's spent so much time dealing with injuries. So, I mean, even last year, he's still trying to get back into that basketball flow. And I think he's just, he's had a great summer so far. He's put on the way. And uh, defensively, he's, he's gifted. He's a, he's a monster defensively. And, I mean, that hasn't changed at all. But I think he's definitely more comfortable in the offensive end than he needs to be. Just from being more familiar, the chemistry growing, just getting more playing time under his belt. And uh, I think he's definitely going to be huge for us on that end, on both ends as well.